After its fantabulous name was shortened, I decided to go out and find out if Birds of Prey was really worth the watch. The Joker and I broke up. I wanted a fresh start. But it turns out I wasn't the only Damon Gotham looking for emancipation. Spectacular news! Miss Queen, she belongs to me. Who are you guys? In the trailers. The first half of the movie is heavy with exposition and the constant voiceover can be irritating at times. Thankfully, the performances and natural charisma from the characters keep you entertained and get you to the climax. Ewan McGregor is the first actor to play a live action adaptation of the famous Batman villain Black Mask and brings an exciting new depth to the character. Margot Robbie continues to shine as Harley Quinn and brings together the other characters to establish the Birds of Prey going forward in the DCEU. The new additions to the universe are Huntress, Black Canary, and Cassandra Cain. The chemistry between all the characters leaves you entertained the entire time, and it's awesome to see this amazing group of ladies teaming up on screen. The costumes are great, the supporting cast is great, and the humor isn't forced like previous comic book films. Overall, it looks like Warner Brothers has learned the formula to making good DC movies and is promising exciting things ahead with Harley's return and the Suicide Squad next summer. I am personally very excited to see the return of the new characters that have been established in Birds of Prey and the journey they will take.